Did you know Pakistan is the world's largest exporter of footballs? But how did our neighbor take the lead over India in this export game? Let's run through the story. Till 2011, footballs were actually the second biggest sports item exported from India. Then Pakistan began making stitchless balls glued together with heat. They were more durable and retained shape better. Pakistan went on to bag contracts for FIFA World Cups 2014 and 18. On the other hand, football's share in total sports good exports from India fell from 12% in FY11 to 3.7% in FY20. India was trailing. Now, nearly 70% of the world's footballs are made only in one Pakistan city, Sialkot. The city has over 1,000 football manufacturers, employing around 60,000 people. Though Pakistan's FIFA ranking is as low as 198, it exported nearly 4 crore balls, worth $154 million, ahead of the 2018 World Cup in Russia. But going back further, what gave birth to this kick-ass production was British colonization. As per reports, in 1886, a British sergeant requested a Sialkot saddle maker to mend his punctured football. The sergeant was so pleased with the saddle maker's work that he placed an order for a bunch of footballs. Since then, the city has kicked off production to a large number. The artisans were known for such high-quality footballs that the city of Sialkot was awarded a contract to manufacture footballs for the 1982 FIFA World Cup. The city is also well known for producing volleyballs, hockey sticks, cricket bats and apparel. And what about India? To regain lost ground, the country needs to improve the mechanization of the football production process. To further accelerate it, experts state the government needs to consider providing a capital subsidy of 15%. For more such interesting stories, tune in to the Novello app.